Hello, you little nuggets. Let's go fishing. All right, so I've got the new camera. I moved myself up in the corner up there. Up there. Where is it? Well, I'm looking at myself. Yeah. <laughs> um, because I think it's a little bit bad. There's nothing up there. The only thing that's behind my head is the time of day, which you can tell. It's night. And the wind, which I never pay attention to. Um, all right, so I did a little bit of research on uh, the skills. Let me bring up the skills. And someone said, I don't need any of these. These just increase the quality of what you can do. So in theory, I can already use a bottom feeder. I don't know if they're right. So we're going to spend some money and maybe screw everything up let's see i don't even know if i can use my existing rig let's let's have a look this is a wait a sec what's my reel my rod rather my rod it does it reset every time this music is <laughs> just really loud yeah it's resetting every time it's annoying okay my rod I wonder if I can use this for bottom feeding I just I, I, I don't know enough I just I don't know enough man bamboo rod I don't think I can use that it's a spinning rod I think I can only use it for spinning you know what let's, uh, let's go in and just buy the other stuff and if we can't do it we'll just go fishing together so what do I need for bottom fishing I need a rod a reel I need line I need a weight is that a sinker what is it called a weight? I can't remember. Pretty sure we used to call it... Didn't we used to call it a weight? For bottom fishing rigs? Sinker. Okay. Yeah. Well, I don't need a good one. I bought this before. So we'll just get the cheap one right there. Should I get one that's a little heavier? No, my rig's crap. So we'll get that. What have I got there? 53 silver. Um, I might want to get some hooks. Because I don't know if I have great hooks. So I will get, I don't want to spend too much, let's just get these. Well, I used to use these hooks for the two little barbs there. I don't think they're very good, but they fucking hurt when they go in your finger, I'll tell you that. So let's get a few of these. Three silver? Oh, I didn't mean to just buy it. Oh. Let's get a 12. Let's get two twelves. Ah, oh, that's annoying. I thought it was one of those things where you click on it and then you get the option of the... <sighs> okay. Uh, oh, I need the bell. Don't forget the bell. Don't forget the bell. Buy indicator. 2.9. Alright, so let's, uh, let's try assembling a rod and see what happens. I don't think it's going to work. So, I've got that. It's not even giving me the option, is it? Which means I can't use it. So, I mean, because I, I should be able to put a bell on here. Unless I can change the rig here. Hang on. Uh, jigging rig from, from North Carolina. I don't want to do any of those things. Wait. Right. Float fishing. Spinning. Bottom fishing. Basic bottom fit. Why is that locked? Oh, why can't I choose that? Now, is it that I can't choose it because they were wrong about the skill up, or is it because I don't have the, the right... Ah. Well, okay. Let's buy the rod. Let's buy the rod. Let's buy the rod. Let's buy the rod. Feed a rod. Let's take the risk. Let's take the risk. What's the worst that can happen? What can this take? Five kilograms. What can that one take? Because I can afford that too. Five kilograms. I, I can't quite afford that. Is it worth waiting? No. We're just going to get this. We're going to do it. We're going to do it. We're going to do it. It's done. No money. Uh, oh, we need bait. Worms. How many did we get? 30 pieces? Just pushing it down, aren't we, gents? And ladies. Um, Alright, let's try that again. Oh, I think I screwed up. Uh, fishing rod. Oh, yeah, look, it was just the rod. Okay, so reel. Oh, I have to disassemble. 
Not disassemble spinning rod. Okay, so I can put the reel on it, which is a three kilogram reel, but remember that. I can put the line on it. So three, that's 3.1, that's 2.2. Would that break the reel? In theory, that will break the reel. I'm not going to risk it. I did it before and it just, it was horrible. I'm probably, someone's going to be watching this again. You're an idiot, but I don't care. Well, I do care if I'm an idiot. I just don't think I am. Put the sinker on. I don't have a leader. Put the classic hook on. There's the fucking thing I bought, the waste of my money. So I have the rusty 16. I have the 40. I'll put the 12 on. And then the bait, we're going to put a worm on. Okay. I'm going to pick that up. I have the rig and I'm going to put that... I'm going to replace because that's no longer valid. So now I have... On one, I have my float fishing. Yes. And on two, I have my... Feeder fishing. Oh, it's just delightful. People, people, people! All right. Let's... Uh, can I buy some bread? Because I really like fishing with bread. Yes, I can. It works so well. Okay, now we have to craft. Crafting is N? Yes. Wait, bread. There we go. Choose the bread. Craft it up. Make it. Don't fail. It can fail. You can fail at making bread. <laughs> How can I fail at breaking up a piece of bread? Whoa, shifty Russians. That's ridiculous. How can I fail twice at making crumbs? Am I just, th am I doing something stupid here? And it's like, well, of course you can't make bread. I just threw away all of my money. I, wait, wait. <laughs> I don't understand it. Cooking? No, uh, baits, would it be under baits? Making ground bait? No. How can I not? Oh, I was thinking worms, I was Preparing wet, but, but I can do, there's no points to put in it. You can just either do it or you can't. So there's no points, so I'm not doing anything wrong. Did I just get really unlucky there? That's annoying. Oh my god, that is really annoying. Don't fail. Don't dick me. Okay, I feel like the game's broken. I have no... That feels broken to me. Oh. Annoying. You know what? Let's uh, let's comment about that. I just failed four times at making wet bread. So you have to move the mouse to stop the chat. It's annoying. Let's see if anyone's got anything to say about that. Okay, so I want to go to that little spot. Oh, <laughs> pleb! Apparently, <laughs> How did, does he know me? Has he met me? How does he know that? Um, I want to go to that spot because I was really liking it. I know you've seen it before, but I was really liking it. I was feeling it, you know what I mean? Where was it? So that was the reeds where I caught nothing. There we go. Look at this. This is the spot. Okay, so where should we put the feeder rod? kind of want to hit those lily pads. I wonder if I can go that far. Let's see. My casting's going to be awful, but that's to be expected. Okay, rod down. Reel it in so we get a little tinkle. Barely hear that. Oh, God, that's not loud enough. <laughs> I've got to turn it back up again. It's not loud enough. I won't be able to hear that. I've got to blow out everyone's eardrums. Okay. 
And then we will go back to some fishing. What's on this? Have I got the maggot on this? Well, I've either got worms or maggots because I don't have any bread. That is so annoying. Oh. Yeah, it's resetting every time. Look at this. I've, my hotkeys have gone as well. They might have reset the server. Oh, I wonder if they reset the server. Because it's still an alpha game. Yeah. That's my guess. This might be a short video. Because they could have broken something here. I, you shouldn't fail four times in a row at, at taking a piece of bread and going like that. I'm getting a bite. Alright, where are we? Come here. Oh god, my everything's too bad. My sensitivity's too high. Let's see, what did I get here? A turn up. There we go, come on. What do we got here? Yeah, a nice little fish. Nice little fishy fishy. Perch. I think that's my first perch. That's why it's saying that, right? Set the retrieval speed way high because we don't need it. And let's see if I can get a little bit closer this time. No. Same spot. Oh, God. I'm going to get that now, aren't I? You just added a minute quarter of a millimeter to your record. Got the bell. Here we go. That's the spot right there. Just fucking annoying about that bread. Because they were biting on bread. That's what was hitting every time. And then I'd switch to maggots. And I caught a roofie. Or a roughie. Which was the worst fish I caught in that whole session. All right. Oh, yeah, that'll do. 800 grams. Here's my guess. Come on, little one. Get the net out. Hey! That was off. It's pretty good. Mm-hmm. I do like this new webcam. It's actually a different. It's not this. It's not that color in this room at all. That color. I keep doing that. I can't point. At <laughs> okay, come on. Come on, fishy. So I read somewhere that the the this game is so detailed that the nature of the way the fish bite will tell you what they are for example roach will do that right which is the oh hello getting a bite on there roach will kind of nibble a little bit and what have you and they're kind of assholes um bream was it bream bream will just confidently go up and take it um carp i think think have a tendency to bite a little bit and then take the bait to a different spot so they'll try and move it somewhere to eat it kind of in privacy i mean if it really does do that i don't know whether i whether that's true or not i just read it so you need the landing net man go on get out there even for little ones you need to land there um i don't know if it's true or not but if that is true that just shows this is such a good game really is. I mean, I know it's a pay to win. You know, but you don't have to pay. I haven't paid a penny and I'm enjoying this. I, I feel I should pay something, but it's perfectly enjoyable at this level. When you get higher level, I mean, I'm so, what am I, level four or five or something. I know that when you get to level 10, 11 or so, it starts to become a real grind. But by the time you get there, you've played a lot. You've You've got your money's worth, your zero dollars worth. I mean, 
you know, I think we expect too much for free these days. We really do. I am I'm guilty of that as well. I lost my float. I looked away and now I can't see my float. Did it get taken? Oh no, there it is, there it is. What's in there? So that little nibble, I'm going with roach or carp. It's kind of delicate. It's not very aggressive. It says if it takes a long time, it's probably a roach. I hear you, Bell. I, I know the rod's going off. I think it's a roach. Oh, shit, I can't see the float now. Oh, they, no, no! God damn it. There we go. Come on. What you got? What you got, boy? Right through those grasses. Let's get you all filthy dirty. Dirty fish. You dirty, dirty fish. Come on, you dirty bugger. I don't I don't think you can tell what fish you've got. Why isn't it coming up? Okay. I don't think you can tell what fish you've got on a feeder rod. I really want to get it on that lily pad. Please. Oh, yes! Hey! Nailed it. I just think it's got a feeling. You know what? I got more than a feeling. More than a feeling. I think I'll do a couple more fish here and then we'll go for a little walk around the lake. Part of me wants to turn the, the audio up so you can hear it and you can kind of feel the piece. But then there's the, those annoying noises in the game that don't have a separate audio control. So if I turn up the sound of the birds and the splashes and the little plops and all of that, you also get bling in your ear balls. So, sorry. What does this look like? What do we think? Place your bets, please. Roach or carp? Roach or carp? It's a little aggressive. I, I, it might be carp. I'm feeling carp. All my money's on carp. It's on carp. I feel, I feel that it's a little gibble. Roach. Yep, knew it. Told you. Oh. Come back. I'm going to pick this up. Pull in this three ounce fish. <laughs> Who is this? This is literally like a 20 grand. Is it Ru Ruffy? My nemesis. Got away and not my fault because it's feeder fish and I don't do about that. Let's have a look around. Let's go. Let's go. We fish right there. Let's try fishing in this. <laughs> oh, I didn't mean to do that. Let's see, can we? Yeah. What do you think? It's not going to work, is it? All right. We'll move on. We'll move on. We'll go elsewhere. Okay, around here. This is probably about where those lily ponds were. Yeah, right there. I could try that. How far out? Maybe I'll try uh, the feeder rod that way. Yes. Out past there. No idea where that went, but that will do. Nope. Alright, so we'll do the feeder rod past there. <laughs> yes, my wife. Yes, queen! We've been watching Pose. And, uh... good show well hmm. it was a good show and then suddenly in this last season okay I have a theory about Pose my theory is that the maker of Pose is doing drugs it's like suddenly got totally fucking wrapped up in drugs 
because the show just went off the rails bad. The final episode. Why can't I install a poll here? I have to go somewhere else. The final episode was such a mess. It was such a bad piece of television that uh, it, it's just drug fueled. It's like the story of Alf. What was that movie with Ben Stiller? Midnight, Midnight Story, Midnight something. Midnight Blue, Blue Midnight. Anyway, that's my theory. The there's drugs involved in that. Um, but the first season was really good. It was really interesting. It was bad acting all the way through and some really bad exposition writing. But it's such a fascinating subject about transsexuals in New York in uh, the 80s. So at the time of... Oh, look, we're in Loki Log. This is Loki Log. Loki Dog. So we'll try here. Uh, transsexuals in the late 80s. Mid-80s to late 80s. Uh, time of AIDS. And it's yeah, just absolutely fascinating subject matter. And this whole society that they made for themselves, really fascinating. Transgender. Um, yeah, so first season is really good. Second season, okay. And at this point, terrible. Embarrassing. So it's worth it for the first season, though. Oh, it's also got one actor in it who's just fantastic. He plays a character called Pray Tell. You'll, you'd see him and go, oh yeah, I know that guy. He's amazing, and this might be a bream. According to my research... Oh, and I, well, I haven't caught one of those. I don't know. Took it real quick, though, did you see that? Um, the guy who plays Pray Tell. God, what an actor he is. Wait. Is that a bell? Sounded like a bell, didn't it? Yes. Yes. Yes, queen. That's our thing. Whoa. Might be a big fish. Um, see, that's our thing from watching Pose. Yes, queen. I used to work in theatre. When I was young, I went, actually went to stage management college when I was young, the Guildhall in London. I used to work in theatre, and uh, when I was crewing, I think it was 42nd Street or Miss Saigon, one of those two shows, there was a club, which name I can't remember right now. Why is this reeling in so slow? I set the speed on this. Is he still pulling? Oh, it's still pulling, that's why. Bloody hell. Come on, mate. In you come. It's good fish. Um, let's push it up a little bit. Oh, we used to go to a club. We used to go raving back in those days. Lots of drugs. Lots of mollies, what they call mollies. We used to call it ease for ecstasy. Lots of that kind of stuff. We used to go to a place called the Vauxhall Tavern, um, which was a pub. And then there was also a club called Strawberry Sundays. And one of those two, I think I've got the name right, but one of those two was a drag club. And um, it was so funny. I used to get my ass slapped all the time. Drag queens loved me. I don't know, it was something about me. They wanted to turn me. Maybe they could if they'd worked hard enough. <laughs> come on you beauty in you come you're all mine that was a long time ago I did like working in theatre though and then I got really sick of it <laughs> like when you're done you're done and now I want to get back into it I've written that play what's going on with this fish and I've got another one waiting on the other line, although I've probably lost it. Yeah, I've lost it by now, the other one. This better be worth it, because you made me lose what could have been a gigantic a, a leviathan. Ooh, it's a fun fish, though, wasn't he? Come on, buddy. Here you get. Obla, obla.
Yeah. It's not bad. Get the rod out, get the lander out for that. Felt bigger, not gonna lie. It's a good fish though. That'll be a few silver. Where did I wish I'd remember where I'd landed that? I think it was just out in the middle, wasn't it? Like out there somewhere? Or did I cast it that way? I think I actually cast it that way, but we'll we'll see. Put the bell on. Ding ding. Remember that? I think that guy's dead, isn't he? Now? Guy who played Apollo Creed and uh, Dutch. Ding! Ding! I think the graphically one of the things that most impresses me is the ripples. They look really good. I mean, I'm sure it's just a texture scrolling. I'm a dev, so, you know, I totally know these things. I'm sure it's just like a texture scrolling along the top. I don't think they're deforming. Maybe they are. But look, that's good, man. That looks really good. No, that's defamation. They're, they're doing some defamation on there. It's the pixels, man. It's all about the pixels. I wonder if they have a water programmer. I used to work on Call of Duty and we had a programmer just for water. Mitten Water. That was the name of the water. That was his name, Mitten. Um, it's very clever. I don't even know if we used it though because it was so expensive to render and but it was fucking clever I'll tell you that you throw grenades in it and deformed and it tessellated according to the impact and it was amazing I wish I had a grenade now I could throw it and kill this fucking fish it's both my dogs crying with me you know, I deal with this shit all day there's nothing there there's absolutely nothing there. They're just bot. Come on, my son. Django, Iggy. Hey, what are you guys doing? They, we speak in full sentences in this house. There's nothing there. Absolutely nothing there. It's just, it's a, it's a crow. That's what it is. They love crows. Especially Iggy. One of my dogs, Django, is very shy, kind of nervous. He's the one that's often sitting over there, the little brown one. Lovely little dog. Such a cute dog. The other one, Iggy, the white one, he's a fucking nutter. <laughs> he's, um, we think he's Jack Russell. He wants to just kill and fuck everything. Come on. Come on. I'm going to eat you little fishy. I'm going to eat you little fishy. Red dwarf. This is a roach. This is exactly how they... No, that's not how they described a roach. This is a miss. Okay. Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to pause the video. going to catch some fish. Come back. When I sell them, you can uh, see how it goes. See you later. Bye.
Well, that was a nightmare's days fishing. Just took awful. <laughs> it's like that sometimes, you know. So I thought I'd uh, end the recording, to be honest here. It's just nothing out there. I mean, look, that's it. And I've been at it for well over an hour. Um, eight silver. But, um, so I thought, rather than struggling against it, I'll call it quits. That's what you do, right? And then uh, I'll start recording the next episode next time I'm actually on the fish and I've got some stuff to show. I might do a bit of fishing in between then, try and get some better gear and stuff like that. But uh, other than that, I will see you on the next episode. I hope you enjoyed uh, watching me do absolutely sweet fuck all. All right, you little nuggets. Bye.